You have no Riz or Aura? Back down and let me have it all! <laughs> you have the, no Riz or the, or the way he hit the ground so hard after jumping off the building. <laughs> Welcome everybody to Flow TV. Now this is not a game, but it's AI. I know how everybody feels about AI. It's taking over the world. It's being used in movies, games, and even being called real art, which I heavily disagree with. It's been a while since I did an AI video. The last time I did it, I was with my friends creating some dumb images. That's Walter that is, White, that bro. Walter like White balling. That, that Walter Walter White, bro. bro. Look at his shirt. Look at he's cooking. <laughs> <laughs> But this one is different. As you can tell, it's a video and it's very high quality. As you can tell, the AI is learning. The AI is just getting better as we go on into the future. A good comparison of how AI has evolved. Look at the Will Smith video of him eating spaghetti compared to now. Legit night and day. But yeah, anyways, let's hop into it. Let's create some dumb little videos. Now, in order to create some AI videos you have to purchase ai credits i think that's stupid as fuck but luckily i did not have to pay a single dime i'm doing a free trial so i got a thousand credits here but anyways let's create a project let's create something dumb uh i don't i honestly don't know what to make all right this is a little stupid one i'm not taking this that seriously so yeah let's go uh, i totally forgot you had to wait <laughs> for it to generate all right well I'll, i guess i'll see you guys when this is done 15 minutes later. Oh, here we go. 99%. Uh, is it going to start? Something going to happen? Guys, it, uh, it's taking a little while for it to load. I don't know why it says 99%. Uh, I think it's broken. All right, guys. It's the next day. Uh, yesterday was not working at all. I tried to create, like, videos, but it just was not working, so I gave up on it. But the next day, it's working. So, yeah. I created three projects here, as you can tell. Uh... You can see the Dragon Ball characters, Goku and Vegeta, looking pretty good, I can't lie. But yeah, anyways, uh, I kind of spoiled myself with these already, so I'm going to show you guys and tell you what I wrote for them. <laughs> Not going to lie, they're pretty cringy, so, you know, just, just stay with me. Alright, for the first one, I wrote down a man walking down a road while Goku from Dragon Ball is talking to him like, super excitedly about fighting Superman that upcoming week. Vegeta is walking beside them as well with his arms crossed, annoyed. Now let's see what it made. Um, it's on honestly not that bad. So next week I get to fight Superman, and I've been training so hard, I can't wait. wait. Oh, really? This is ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's about it. It's honestly not that bad. The Vegeta character is honestly on point, kind of, I can't lie. Goku's a bit wonky Super because he's talking and he just doesn't look like Goku. I don't know why they're, they're the same height as well. Goku's way taller. And also, I just love how there's just this random dude here. This is ridiculous. <laughs> this is ridiculous. They got the suits pretty well done, I can't lie, too. I mean, look at Vegeta. Vegeta does not look that bad, guys. Come on, he looks kind of on point with how he looks like. Goku's a bit weird. I don't know why. Look at his face. He looks weird. All right, you know what? I'll give that one a... I'll give that a, a 7 out of no, 6 out of 10. It's not that bad. It's not good, but yeah. All right, let's go on to the next one. I honestly did not know they made the second one. I didn't watch this one yet. <laughs> let's see. I don't know why Goku... What the hell does this stand for? Why is there a B in his uh, suit here? Uh, There's no audio at all. So we don't know what they're talking about. Also, why is Goku in anime form and this guy's just like real... Goku traveled to the real uh universe. All right, this is the second one I made. Tell it's gonna be brain rot just by <laughs> the logo you see there. And as you can tell, I went full director mode with this. I went full on like, you know, making a whole goddamn movie <laughs> because I just wanted to see what it would do. It's pretty cringy, I can't lie. So just stay with me. I'm gonna read all this. <laughs> all right, so I wrote down, create a movie trailer type video with a 1.851 aspect ratio of a superhero called the Rizzler. He is three feet tall. He wears a mask that only covers his eyes. He has a tight spandex suit that's black, white, and gold with the logo Riz in the middle of his chest and a cape. The trailer starts off with a close-up shot of the logo in the middle of his chest. Then the camera pans out slowly. His eyes are closed and he is standing on top of a high building. Then the next shot is a close-up shot of his eyes while he's slowly breathing. Then he opens his eyes and jumps off a building. He free falls for a second right when he is about to hit the ground. He points his hand forward and starts flying through cars in a busy road. The next shot shows him charging up and screaming, changing the colors of his suit to red and black, similar to how Dragon Ball characters do. As you can tell, I love Dragon Ball. Leave me alone. The next shot, he is fighting a giant villain. 
named Goldie dressed in all gold with white smoke forming around him. They are fighting on top of a mountain with gold flakes falling onto them. The Rizzler punches Goldie and uses laser beams from his eyes at him. Goldie pulls out a hammer made of all gold and swings it towards the Rizzler, hitting him, causing him to fly off the mountain. In the next shot, the Rizzler is badly damaged with those black and white and gold suit being a little torn up. He is crying, looking up at the sun. In the next shot, Goldie is dipping his hand into the river of gold. A river of gold slowly forms onto Goldie's hand and body... <laughs> making him glow in the next shot the rizzler is in normal clothes in his room staring at his black gold and white suit in the closet in the next shot the villain speaks to the rizzler saying you have no riz or aura back down and let me have it all the rizzler screams and runs towards goldie the camera then cuts to the rizzler charging up screaming and changing the colors of his suit to blue and white the video cuts to a logo called the rizzler yeah this is brain raw activity right here <laughs> all right now that we're done with that let's watch this video you have no Riz or Aura? Back down and let me have it all! <laughs> you have the, no the way Riz he hit or the or The way he hit the ground so hard after jumping off the building. He's supposed to fly. Why is he hitting the ground? Look at this. Aura, back down and let me have it all! <laughs> he, he bounced up. Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? He's supposed to fly. What the hell, man? Not gonna lie, they got this character here pretty good. Goldie, he's a giant ass friggin' uh monster he has a gold hammer as well look at this that's pretty good i can't lie uh i don't know why he has the laser beams uh the, the rizzler is supposed to have it all right i don't know what the hell this is why is he like what's this on his face what's going on <laughs> this one's honestly not that bad like suit is black white and gold he has the uh riz logo on him he's on top of a building pans out slowly like like i prompted and his eyes are closed too now he's not supposed to be talking here i don't know why i expected like the, the ai to do a one-to-one -one comparison to what i wrote down i honestly might rate this a 7 out of 10 because it's a little accurate and it prompt everything i wrote down but but it's still like somewhat got it down a little and plus he hits the ground pretty hard here which gives it an extra point so seven out of ten all right this one here i wrote down create anime type of video with 24 frames per second where shrek is wall running off a wall and backflips over a log <laughs> while getting chased by the character death from the movie puss in boots the last wish death throws his sight towards shrek but shrek catches it and throws it back striking death in the head now for this one i forgot to put the audio so you're not going to hear anything but it's this one's pretty bad i can't lie i mean look at this like what the hell anime type stuff this is not anime it's like a freaking kid show this is something you see if they had a shrek show i mean let's be honest and this is not death who the fuck is this he also didn't shrek didn't even catch it he just he just freaking got hit by the sight he's supposed to catch it throw it back this one gets a 2 out of 10. At least they got the Shrek character. Um, honestly, no. A 1 out of 10. I mean, this is bad. They only got Shrek right. They got the character wrong. And yeah, 1 out of 10. This is terrible. All right, for this one, I said create a realistic video of an astronaut floating in space. And you can see the galaxy, stars, and planets behind him. You can see the reflection of the sun off his helmet. You can hear his breathing from inside the suit. He has a camera with him taking pictures while floating in space. I hope this one's pretty good because, you know, what... The realistic stuff they have i'm hoping this one would be actually like a very fire one. Oh my god look at this shit this looks real this looks pretty good yo they're on the place of what is this <laughs> about the music about to play in the background hold up continue that i want to i want to hear that i mean they have the whole galaxy in the background the planets the stars this looks this looks beautiful they have the reflection as well that's pretty fire the reflection and of, of, of his hands too and everything else and the camera too oh my god this is pretty good and look at this now what were they about to play this sounds like some travis scott was about to play this gets a 9 out of 10. Very good, very high quality. And also, whatever they were playing, about to play in the end, they need to finish that because that was fire. For this next one, I said to create a high quality video of a realistic Godzilla roaming the oceans, roaring, causing the water around him to vibrate and shake. I hope this one's fire. I hope it's just not some weird thing like the Shrek one earlier. Here we go. It's done. Let's see. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Okay, what? Well, come on, he's supposed to be roaring. I mean, he got the water physics down a little bit. This one's mid, all right, guys. I can't lie. This one gets this gets a five out of ten. They got Godzilla right. His character model doesn't look that bad, to be honest. And yeah, this one's 
Okay, create a realistic horror video where we are in the point of view of a webcam walking in the dark woods with a flashlight lighting the trees ahead. A tall skinny white creature is peeking behind a tree with his left hand gripping onto the tree and his right hand pointing towards us. I am kind of excited to see how this goes. I do love horror stuff, so I'm hoping this comes out very well. Oh my god, this is about to be scary, y'all. Let's go, let's see what happens. Oh my god, this is a lot of not gonna lie, Why am I actually scared? Hold up, hold up. All right, let me lower it down. I have to lower that shit down. Oh my god, I see the creature already. Oh hell no. Why is that low key scary? Wait. Uh. I don't, oh my god, that was kind of scary. I can't lie, guys. It got the woods down pretty good. Not how I imagined it. I expected larger trees, but this is still pretty good. The creature, I, I kind of wanted him a bit bigger, but I mean, this is pretty scary still. This is how I did imagine him around the tree, though. They got this down pretty good. He's not that scary, but not gonna lie, it did give me a little bit of the creeps. I can't lie. So, you know what? This one, I'll give this one an 8 out of 10. I don't know why I was expecting a jump scare, but... Yeah, and also they have the sound of like the walking in the woods. That's pretty good as well. So 8 out of 10, uh, I messed with this one. As you can tell by uh, this one, it's gonna, it looks pretty good. In this one I said, create a high quality realistic video of a newsman in a suit interviewing Mario from the Mario games in front of the Nintendo headquarters about the prices of the Nintendo games. Mario has an Italian accent and high pitched voice. He is so mad that he is cursing at the CEOs of Nintendo for raising the prices of the Nintendo games from $70 to $90. The reason I put it, Mario has an Italian accent and high pitched voice is because sometimes they'll just make him have a regular human voice, so I had to correct them on that. Anyways, let's see how this goes. I am so angry, you scumbags! I understand, but I think. <laughs> you think what? He <laughs> just said you think and then just stopped. And oh my god, look at the freaking the microphone that Mario is. And see, I told you guys, look, he doesn't have a freaking Italian accent, which I'm kind of annoyed, but it's still, it's still pretty funny. I am so angry, you scumbags! He called them scumbags. Damn, Nintendo. Wait, also, what the hell is this? This does not say Nintendo. Nine some? What? That's that's kind of sus. Not gonna lie. This one's pretty good. It's pretty funny. Uh, he did call them. He did call Nintendo scumbags, which they are scumbags. I did wish he uh should have thrown in a curse word in there, like you know, fuck or something. But yeah, that's this one's pretty good. I'll give this one a hmm, seven <gasps> out of ten. They got the news. The news anchor man looks real as fuck. Looks like a real person. Mario's obviously you know <laughs> just there. That, yeah, but this one's pretty good. Seven out of ten. <laughs> All right, for this one, as you can tell by the image, it's gonna be funny. I told AI to create a high quality realistic video of a fat Discord mod sitting in his greasy gaming chair on his computer. Then a SWAT team breaks into his room, telling him to get onto the floor, screaming at him. Let's see how this one goes. Uh, as you can tell, they got the Discord mod down pretty well. It's very accurate. This does not look fake at all. Get on the floor now! <laughs> look at his eyes. And he's out of breath too. Oh my god, this is pretty good. Where does glasses go to watch? They just vanished off of him. What does this move watch? They say get on the floor before the SWAT team's even in the room and he just backs up watch. Get on the floor now! What the hell? Also, they, the breaking down of the door looks pretty good. Watch this. Look at that. That was pretty cool. I can't lie. Look at his eyes. He's shooken in fear. Look, he's looking at the computer wondering like, what the fuck is that? Is he EDP? I don't know. Not gonna lie. This one gets a 9 out of 10. I, I, come on, guys. This one gets a 9 out of 10. It's pretty good. Very accurate to real life. All right, guys. And for the last one, this is the final one. Unfortunately, I don't have any more credits, so I can't do any more, unfortunately. I would have to buy some, and I'm not doing that. Fuck that. But anyways, they created two for me here, so good thing we got a good use out of it. I told the AI to generate a high quality realistic ASMR type video of a very sharp knife cutting out the diamonds of a diamond Minecraft block from the game Minecraft. Make it a close up shot and make the diamonds of the knife cutting out the diamonds of the diamond Minecraft block very soothing. And just by this, this, this looks pretty cool. And here we go. It looks, they got the Minecraft block pretty good. All right, let's go. I'm kind of excited for this one. Oh my God. This is very ASMR-ish. Oh my. That was, that's good. That was a good ass one. What the hell? Oh my God. This is the type of videos you throw on freaking TikTok and it gets like a million views. I'm going to give this one a 8 out of 10. 
just because it's not really kind of how I imagined. I think I could have. I think it's my fault. I could have worded it better. I expected like the raw Minecraft block with the di little diamonds in it and the rock and just like the knife picking at the diamonds, cutting it out. I could have you know, worded it better. So it's a bit my fault. So yeah, I'm, I'm giving it an 8 out of 10. All right, and then we have this one here. Uh, this is the, f I think this is the first one I, I ended up doing, but then I exited it out because I forgot to put the audio in it. So it just generated whatever this is. Let's see what this is. <laughs> what the hell is this? What am I looking at? Uh, That's kind of cool. They got the freaking, uh, they have the freaking uh, little animation of when you're breaking the block. That, I, I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty cool. Look at that, that was sick. And they have the freaking uh, Minecraft thing down here too. I'm pretty sure they just stole that. All right, guys. Well, that was it for this AI video. Not gonna lie, these were pretty cool. I like this one. This one was sick. Some of these were pretty awesome, like the Diamond Minecraft one, the Discord mod one. The scary one is pretty good. Mario, you know how that goes. Mario is always cool. You have the bo you have the boys in here, Goku and Vegeta. You know that goes well. And they and we have our very own Rizzler movie. <laughs> down here but yeah guys if you enjoyed the video leave a like hit the subscribe button and i'll see you guys next time